your latest news update from Western Mass News. I'm Chris Pisano with a look at your headlines. People across Western Mass experience power outages down power lines or fallen trees due to high winds and icy conditions Friday. In Wilbraham, a portion of Main Street was closed off as crews removed a fallen tree from a house. And over in East Long Meadow, an area of Prospect Street closed down between Chestnut Street and Western View Drive due to downed electrical wires. National Grid saying serious repairs are needed. Massachusetts Congressman John Olver has died. Governor Maura Healey has ordered flags be lowered to half staff at all state buildings in his honor. She also issued a statement saying, quote, Congressman John Oliver dedicated his life to serving the people of Western and Central Massachusetts and always stayed true to his values. He was a strong advocate for affordable health care, abortion access, public transportation, and rural communities. I'll always be grateful for his kindness and his friendship. He'll be dearly missed, and my heart goes out to his loved ones. M. Jim Springfield announcing comedian Kevin Hart will appear in Springfield later this year. Hart's reality check tour will stop at the Mass Mutual Center on Thursday, April 20th. Along with stand-up comedy, Hart's also known for his roles in many movies. Tickets go on sale March 3rd. I'm meteorologist Jana Brown to check if your forecast as we head into Saturday, cold temperatures expected. Starting off in the single digits and ending up only in the low to mid 20s for afternoon highs. Cloud cover will be around throughout the day and there's a chance for scattered snow showers and flurries, especially in the early afternoon. May cause some minor accumulations uh, because of that fluffy factor of the snow it's going to pile up, but only an inch or two expected across the hills. Then on Sunday, milder with more of a breeze out of the southwest, highs hitting low 40s, with a chance for some scattered rain and snow showers towards the end of the day with a passing cold front. Behind that front, we're dry going into Monday, but we're already tracking our next storm system. A powerful storm making its way toward the Great Lakes on Monday and forming a secondary low right off the mid-Atlantic coast. That low will be bringing us snow starting Monday night, lasting out through Tuesday. Some significant snow accumulation is a possibility for us here in Western Mass, so it's looking likely we'll have some first alert weather days with possibly six or more inches of snow expected. Wednesday, we're dry. Thursday, a few rain and snow showers are back, and we're watching another potential storm to end the week. Stay with Western Mass News on air, online, and on our app throughout the day for breaking news, weather, and exclusive content.